Time's wasting, Mr. Miles. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. We're nearly done, you know. And then what? You'll see. Maybe they'll even let you watch when it begins. It's not as terrible as you think. Look, I know you're not gonna let me leave. So why not tell me what's going on? Humor me. I'm not an idiot, Mr. Miles. I think you've already learned quite a bit. I don't know what you're talking about. Of course not. All right, let me ask you something else then. Yes? Some of the stuff I'm seeing in the Animus, sometimes it seems wrong. Untrue, like the history is off somehow. It doesn't... It doesn't what, Mr. Miles? Match up with what you read on an online encyclopedia? What your high school history teacher taught you? Let me ask you something. Do these supposed experts have access to secret knowledge, kept hidden from the rest of us? There are books, letters, documents, all sorts of source material from back then. Some of it seems to contradict what the Animus is showing me. Anyone can write a book, and they can put whatever they want on its pages. Anything. <laughs> Used to be we thought the world was flat. Some people still do. Yes, and they publish books about it. Or that the moon landing was a hoax. I believe there's also a book claims the world was created in seven days. A bestseller, too. Where's this going, Doc? The point, I suppose, is that you shouldn't trust everything you hear, everything you read. What's that your ancestors said? Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. Yes, exactly. It's part of what makes the Animus so spectacular. There's no room for misinterpretation. There's always room. Touché, Mr. Miles. Now that I've answered your question, can we begin? Killing some of your Come in, my student. We have much to discuss. We are close, Altair. Robert de Sable is now all that stands between us and victory. It is his mouth gives the orders. His hand pays the gold. With him dies the knowledge of the Templar treasure and any threat it might pose. I still don't understand how a simple bit of treasure could cause so much chaos. The peace of Eden is temptation given form. Merely look at what it's done to Robert. Once he tasted of its power, the thing consumed him. He saw not a dangerous weapon to be destroyed, but a tool. One that would help him realize his life's ambition. He dreamed of power then? Yes and no. He dreamed, still dreams, like us, of peace. But this is a man who sought to see the Holy Land consumed by war. No, Altair. How can you not see when you're the one that opened my eyes to this? What do you mean? What do he and his followers want? A world in which all men are united. I do not despise his goal. I share it. But I take issue with the means. Peace is something to be learned, to be understood, to be embraced. He would force it and rob us of our free will in the process. Strange to think of him in this way. Never harbor hate for your victims, Altair. Such thoughts are poison and will cloud your judgment. Could he not be convinced then to end his mad quest? I spoke to him in my way through you. What was each killing if not a message? But he has chosen to ignore us. Then there's only one thing left to do. Jerusalem is where you faced him first. It's where you'll find him now. Let this final offering lend you strength. Go, Altair. It's time to finish this.
going what to cause doing? trouble. What is that fool doing? Focus on your target. Where is he going? That nothing distracts. <laughs> Is he running from someone? Use counter attacks when faced with multiple enemies to gain. Safety and peace, Altair. Upon you as well, brother. Seems fate has a funny way with things. So it's true then. Robert de Sable is in Jerusalem. I've seen the knights myself. Only misfortune follows that man. If he's here, it's because he intends ill. I won't give him the chance to act. Do not let vengeance cloud your thoughts, brother. We both know no good can come of that. I have not forgotten. You have nothing to fear. I do not seek revenge, but knowledge. Truly, you are not the man I once knew. My work has taught me many things, revealed secrets to me. But there are still pieces of this puzzle I do not possess. What do you mean? All the men I've laid to rest have worked together, united by this man. Robert has designs upon the land. This much I know for certain. But how and why, when and where, these things remain out of reach. Crusaders and Saracens working together? They are none of these things, but something else. Templars. The Templars are a part of the Crusader army. Or so they'd like King Richard to believe. No. Their only allegiance is to Robert de Sable and some mad idea that they will stop the war. You spin a strange tale. You have no idea, Malik. But tell me where they've been seen. I should be after him before he slips away. Three places I can say for certain. West of here, near both a guard tower and a hospital. And to the southwest, at the Church of the Holy Sepulchre. See what you can learn. I will do the same. I'll be quick as I can. Stay safe, my friend. Turn back now! and peace, master. Have you seen all the vile Templars in town? 
I have been ordered to kill as many as I can before the burial of your latest victim, Mudged Udin. I am sure if it were your mission, it would be done in no time. I have learned much while looking for those Templars. I will share valuable information with you when you get back. Stop it, please! You're hurting me! That hurts! Stop it, please! So what have I done wrong? How Just about you turn around and go away? I beg of you. I beg of you. Just a few coins, please. No, you don't understand. I have nothing. No, you don't understand. I have no idea. Man, you're going to have to be. Go pester someone else. <laughs> Kalabalık ön içine karışmayı seviyor. Gözünüzü dört açın. Kimsenin sizi kandırmasına izin ver. Gözünüzü dört açın. Geri dönecek. That shirt will be the mark. You say they're nice, walk the streets of Jerusalem, and not in occupation. There is no evil in their hearts. Could you spare a few coins? And so we must seize this opportunity. Begin a dialogue. Make a man. What? What is it that you want? Please, sir, have any money? No, please don't leave. Just a few. Points. I know now why I joined our clan. Just to be in your presence is a gift from God. This is what I have learned about Robert's men. They are well prepared for battle. To fight them all at once would be unwise. Better to let them chase you for a while before striking back. But it is disrespectful for me to tell a master how he should behave in combat. Forgive me, master. Just a little money, I beg you. I've got nothing. Ah! 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 
Hasan one expected oh, defeat. I will end your life. Thank you. Thank you. I'll find a way to repay this kindness, I swear it. Often spoke of, never acted upon. But today is different. Crusader knights walk the streets of Jerusalem and not in occupation. There is no evil in their hearts. And so we must seize this opportunity. Begin a dialogue, make amends, together we might finally bring truth to the ever-ephemeral promise of peace. We must be strong, we must be brave, and we must find the courage to face those we once called our enemies and now instead call them friends. The Crusaders come to Jerusalem bringing with them an opportunity to end the fighting, to stop the war. That we may stand as one, we must not turn them away. Please, can't you spare something? I'm poor and sick and hungry. A few coins. All I ask is for a few coins. No, you don't understand. Never have I seen such insults. It isn't right. <laughs> You speak of peace, but your words are hollow. No, I speak the truth. Why would you say other? You're a Templar. So I am. Then you are also a liar and a fraud, just like your master. Where is he? What does he intend? It's peace he seeks, I swear it. And the proof is in his actions. A Christian at a Muslim's funeral. We want an end to all of this. Only because it serves your needs. But this is a noble thing we want. The land will be united beneath our banner. United through force. You'd enslave us all. It is for the best. No, it's not. And so long as my brothers and I breathe, you will not succeed. All right, where are you? Thousands of lives are lost in its defense! It is a tragedy! But I say, this is an honor! To die in service to God! Fighting well for what we believe in! Well there is no greater glory than this! What is Could I doing? interest you in some of my wares? I stand before you to deliver a warning! To it's forbidden for you to be here! There will be no stopping him! Fool must be out of his mind. Come, people, come see what I brought. You won't believe your eyes. Find his squares in all the land. Away with you! I'll have your head! Give up! You've nowhere to run! Infidel! You will die here! You won't get away from me! He's close. He must be.
see that the guards are placed accordingly. We'll be safe enough during the procession. It's the burial that worries me. Easy for our enemies to hide amongst the crowd. If you're so concerned, why not post your own men? Search the site yourselves. Our presence here has caused enough chaos. I can only imagine how the people would react, seeing Crusader soldiers marching across their holy ground. Then perhaps you should not attend at all. He was our friend and brother and we will honor him as he passes from this world. You insult me by suggesting otherwise. I'll post the men. I don't want trouble either. Then stop trying to make it and do as you've been asked. My family is sitting Could you spare this coin? Where is the one responsible for this? A few coins. All I ask is for a few coins. I beg of you. I Madame. beg of you just a Madame few Lady coins, please. No, please don't leave. Just a few coins, please. Please, 
Can't you spare something? I'm poor and sick and stupid. I beg of you. I beg of you just a few coins, please. I need food. I'm so hungry. Just a little money, I beg of you. I'm so hungry. Just a little money, I beg of you. I would end the morning that. the scent of success about you, brother. I've learned much about our enemy. Share your knowledge, then. Let us see what can be done with it. Robert and his Templars walk the city. They've come to pay their respects to Mejduddin. They'll attend his funeral, which means so will I. What is this that Templars would attend his funeral? I have yet to divine their true intentions, though I'll have a confession in time. The citizens themselves are divided. Many call for their lives. Still others insist that they are here to parley, to make peace. Peace? I told you. The others I've slain have said as much to me. That would make them our allies. And yet we killed them. Make no mistake, we are nothing like these men. Though their goal sounds noble, the means by which they'd achieve it are not. At least, that's what Al Mualim told me. So what is your plan? I'll attend the funeral and confront Robert. The sooner the better. Fortune favor your blade, brother. Malik, before I go, there's something I should say. Be out with it. I've been a fool. Normally I'd make no argument, but what is this? What are you talking about? All this time, I never told you I was sorry. Too damn proud. You lost your arm because of me. Lost Qadr. You had every right to be angry. I do not accept your apology. I understand. No. You don't. I do not accept your apology because you are not the same man who went with me into Solomon's temple. And so you have nothing to apologize for. Malik. Perhaps if I had not been so envious of you, I would not have been so careless myself. I'm just as much to blame. Don't say such things. We are one. As we share the glory of our victories, so too should we share the pain of our defeat. In this way, we grow closer. We grow stronger. Thank you, brother. Rest if you need to, Altair, that you might be ready for what lies ahead. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Come no further. Versus that, garage and I'm not acting like a child. That hurts! Stop 
We gather here to mourn the loss of our beloved Majdid Din. Taken too soon from this world, I know you feel sorrow and pain at his passing, but you should not. For just as we are all brought forth from the womb, so too must we all one day pass from this world. It is only natural, like the rising and the setting of the sun. Take this moment to reflect on his life and give thanks for all the good he did. Know that one day you will stand with him again in paradise. As you know, this man was murdered. We have tried to track his killer, but it has proved difficult. These creatures cling to the shadows and run from any who would face them fairly. But not today, for it seems one stands among us. He mocks us with his presence and must be made to pay. Seize him! Bring him forward that God's justice might be done! <laughs> Belki farkında değilsin ama hali Yeni gözün kapalı bile yenerim. Seni yenemeyeceksin. Seni gözün kapalı bile yenerim. Gel buraya. Kaçmasına izin vermeyeceksin. Gel buraya. Oh, 
you expected someone else what sorcery is this no sorcery we knew you'd come Robert needed to be sure he'd have time to get away so he flees we cannot deny your success you have laid waste to our plans first the treasure then our men control of the Holy Land slipped away but then he saw an opportunity to reclaim what has been stolen to turn your victories to our advantage Al Muallam still holds your treasure, and we've routed your army before. Whatever Robert plans, he'll fail again. Ah, but it's not just Templars you'll contend with now. Speak sense. Robert rides for Asa to plead his case that Saracen and Crusader unite against the Assassins. That will never happen. They have no reason to. Had, perhaps. But now you've given them one. Nine, in fact. The bodies you've left behind, victims on both sides. You've made the assassins an enemy in common and ensured the annihilation of your entire order. Well done. Not nine. Eight. What do you mean? You were not my target. I will not take your life. You're free to go, but do not follow me. I don't need to. You're already too late. We'll see. Beni yenemeyeceğim. Don't let him get away! 
that will cost you your life! Die, please! was a trap. I had heard the funeral turned to chaos. What happened? Robert de Sable was never here. He sent another in his stead. He was expecting me. You must go to Al Mualim. There's no time. She told me where he's gone, what he plans. If I return to Masyaf, he might succeed. And then, I fear we'll be destroyed. We have killed most of his men. He cannot hope to mount a proper attack. Wait, did you say she? Yes, it was a woman. Strange, I know. But that's for another time. For now, we must focus on Robert. We may have thinned his ranks, but the man is clever. He goes to plead his case to Richard and Salah Hedin, to unite them against the common enemy. Against us. Surely you're mistaken. This makes no sense. These two men would never... Oh, but they would. And we have ourselves to blame. The men I've killed. Men on both sides of the conflict. Men important to both leaders. Robert's plan may be ambitious, but it makes sense, and it could work. Look, brother, things have changed. You must return to Masyaf. We cannot act without our master's permission. It could compromise the Brotherhood. I thought... I thought you had learned this. Stop hiding behind words, Malik. You wield the Creed and its tenants like some shield. He's keeping things from us, important things. You were the one told me we could never know anything, only suspect. Well, I suspect this business with the Templars goes deeper. When I'm done with Robert, I will ride for Masyaf that we may have answers. But perhaps you could go now. I cannot leave the city. Then walk amongst its people. Seek out those who served the ones I slew. Learn what you can. You call yourself perceptive. Perhaps you'll see something I could not. I don't know. I must think on this. Do as you must, my friend. But it's time I ride for Arsuf. Every moment I delay, our enemy gets one step ahead of me. Be careful, brother. I will be. I promise. Just run into that person and kill him. Filthy hand! 
انه يهرب الى طريق المسجد لقد انتهى تحركوا يو كانت اسكيب Refill your stock. What would cause him to run like that? Focus on your target. Let now what would cause him to run like that? He's going to hit someone. Ah! Ah! Don't do that again, understand? You, you almost killed me. Where is he going? When you are exposed, throwing soldiers from rooftop. the anime. 
this shows you are being watched by an important... Er ist ein toter Mann, wenn er sich erneut hier zeigt. Ja! Ja! Oh, oh. Over here! Fight! Fight. <laughs> 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 
Come no further. Hold a moment. It's words I bring, not steal. Offering terms of surrender then? It's about time. You misunderstand. It's Al Muallam who sends me, not Salah ad -Din. Assassin! What is the meaning of this? And be quick with it! You've a traitor in your midst. And he has hired you to kill me? Come to gloat about it before you strike? I wouldn't be taken so easily! It's not you I've come to kill. It's him. Speak then! That I may judge the truth. Who is this traitor?
Robert de Sable. My lieutenant! <laughs> he aims to betray. That's not the way he tells it. He seeks revenge against your people for the havoc you've wrought in Arkham. And I am inclined to support him. Some of my best men were murdered by some of yours. It was I who killed them, and for good reason. Hear me out. William of Montferrat. He sought to use his soldiers to take Akka by force. Gagné de Naplus. He would use his skills to indoctrinate and control any who resisted. Sabrand. He intended to block the ports, preventing your kingdom from providing aid. They betrayed you, and they took their orders from Robert. You expect me to believe this outlandish tale? You knew these men, better than I. Are you truly surprised to learn of their ill intentions? Is this true? My liege, it is an assassin that stands before us. These creatures are masters of manipulation. Of course it isn't true. I've no reason to deceive. Oh, but you do. You're afraid of what will happen to your little fortress. Can it withstand the combined might of the Saracen and the Crusader army? My concern is for the people of the Holy Land. If I must sacrifice myself for there to be peace, so be it. This is a strange place we find ourselves in. Each of you accusing the other. There really is no time for this. I must be off to meet with Saladin and enlist his aid. The longer we delay, the harder this will become. Hold a moment, Robert. Why? What do you intend? Surely you do not believe him? It is a difficult decision, one I cannot make alone. I must leave it in the hands of one wiser than I. Thank you. No, Robert, not you. Then who? The Lord. Let this be decided by combat. Surely God will side with the one whose cause is righteous. If this is what you wish. It is. So be it. Two arms, assassin! Oh, dear! Done then. Your schemes, like you, are put to rest. <laughs> you know nothing of schemes. You're but a puppet. He betrayed you, boy, just as he betrayed me. Speak sense, Templar, or not at all. Nine men he sent you to kill, yes? The nine who guarded the treasure's secret. What of it? It wasn't Nine who found the treasure, Assassin. Not Nine, but Ten. A Tenth? None may live who carry the secret. Give me his name. 
Oh, but you know him well. And I doubt very much you'd take his life as willingly as you've taken mine. Who? It is your master, Al Mualim. But he is not a Templar. Did you never wonder how it is he knew so much? Where to find us? How many we numbered? What we aspired to attain? He is the master of the assassins. We, oui. master of lies. You and I just two more pawns in his grand game. And now, with my death, only you remain. Do you think he'll let you live, knowing what you do? I've no interest in the treasure. Ah, but he does. The only difference between your master and I is that he did not want to share. No. Ironic, isn't it? That I, your greatest enemy, kept you safe from harm. But now you've taken my life, and in the process, ended your own. Well fought, assassin. It seems God favors your cause this day. God had nothing to do with it. I was the better fighter. Ah, you may not believe in him, but it seems he believes in you. Before you go, I have a question. Ask it then. Why? Why travel all this way? Risk your life a thousand times, all to kill a single man. He threatened my brothers and what we stand for. Ah, vengeance then. No, not vengeance. Justice, that there might be peace. This is what you fight for? Peace? Do you see the contradiction? Some men cannot be reasoned with. Like that madman, Saladin. I think he'd like to see an end to this war as much as you. So I've heard, but never seen. Even if he doesn't say it, it's what the people want. Saracen and Crusader alike. The people know not what they want. It's why they turn to men like us. Then it falls to men like you to do what is right. <laughs> Nonsense. We come into the world kicking and screaming. Violent and unstable. It is what we are. We cannot help ourselves. No. We are what we choose to be. <laughs> Your kind. Always playing with words. I speak the truth. There's no trick to be found here. We'll know soon enough. But I fear you cannot have what you desire this day. Even now, that heathen Saladin cuts through my men and I must attend to them. But perhaps, having seen how vulnerable he is, he will reconsider his actions. Yes. In time, what you seek may be possible. You were no more secure than him. Do not forget that. The men you left behind to rule in your stead did not intend to serve you for longer than they had yes. to. Yes. Yes. I am well aware. Then I'll take my leave. My master and I have much to discuss. It seems that even he is not without fault. He is only human, as are we all. You, as well. Safety and peace be upon you. I said get up, goddammit! Listen! Oh no. Seems your assassin friends found us. What? How'd you do it, Desmond? Hey, hey, look, I don't know what you're talking about, but whatever's going on down there has got nothing to do with me. They're here for you, and I sure as shit didn't invite them. What's the situation down there? We're taking heavy fire. Can you contain it, or do I need to evacuate the prisoner? Only five or six. We've got them outnumbered. A couple have wounded, but we'll pull through. We'll get it under control. God damn you, Desmond. You couldn't leave well enough alone. I told you I had nothing to do with this. How would I even contact them? Telepathy? Come on. Doesn't matter. They'll be dead soon enough. Here, have a listen. That's been neutralized. Looks like the cavalry won't be coming. Dunno, Doc. We're freaking out a minute ago. 
A little research facility not as secure as you thought it was? Worried they'll be back with more? I don't think so, Desmond. What Lucy here is trying to say is that there aren't any assassins left to come for you. We've been very busy this past year, hunting down your little enclaves, your desert communes and whatnot. I'm afraid you're on your own. Rest up, Mr. Miles. Tomorrow, we finish this.